What's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. I am Nick here with Ryan and Ty. Uh, uh, it's been a while since I have brought some hip hop to the channel. Uh, I couldn't even tell you the last time, to be honest. And that's why today I have brought Gangstar. Have you guys ever heard of them? No, never. Mm, wow. No. Okay, so they are an American hip hop group consisting of Texas record producer DJ Premier and Massachusetts rapper Guru. They are considered one of the best MC and producer duos in hip hop history. They released seven studio albums. And sadly, Guru passed away. Rest in peace. This song features a verse from Guru and a verse from Inspector Deck. Not Inspector. Inspector. That's very important. <laughs> Do not say Inspector. Inspector. And he is actually a critically acclaimed rapper. Most notably, he was a member of Wu-Tang Clan, which is one of the biggest rap groups of all time. So today we're gonna do Above the Clouds. This is actually one of the most popular songs. The song tells a tale of religion, prophets, spirituality, war, and all that is supreme. This is from the fifth album, Moment of Truth, released in 1998. I think we're ready. And uh, I'm excited because I'm just gonna sit here and say it. This is one of my favorite hip hop songs of all time. Oh, so, bold statement. Not afraid to say. So let's get into it. Gangstar, Above the Clouds. It has come to our attention that a mysterious force is loose somewhere in outer space. The mysteries of creation are there. Up in the sky? Up in the sky. The moon and the planets are there. And new hopes for knowledge and peace are there. And therefore, as we set sail, we ask God's blessing on the most hazardous, and dangerous and greatest adventure on which man has ever embarked. Shall bring disaster to evil factors Demonic chapters shall be captured by kings Through the storms of days after And to the earth from the sun through triple darkness To blast you with a force that can't be compared To any firepower for its mind power shared The brainwave causes vessels to circulate Like constellations reflect at night off the lake Word to the father and mother earth Seek an everlasting life through this hell for what it's worth Look, listen and observe and watch it. Classic. Oh, Classic. Yeah. It's got that old school vibe. So what do you think about the instrumental? Oh, it's fire. Oh, it's fire. Yeah. It's fire, it's isn't it? fire, yeah. Oh, boy. It's one of the best instrumentals of all time, if you were asking me. It just kind of has like a peaceful feeling to it. I just, I just think of meditation. It almost sounds like a remix of something you would hear if you walked into a spa. That's what it sounds like really? to me. I was yeah. catching like a city vibe. Like oh, okay. I'm walking down with a coffee in my hand. Yeah. Well, it's kind of a mix, yeah. to be honest. This is a coffee? A, a coffee. What type of coffee? <laughs> decaf. <laughs> okay. I don't know. That's the first thing that came to mind, decaf. Yeah, no, that actually works. And I kind of like how it has an Eastern vibe to it. You know, like, like that, that Asian mm -hmm. vibe. Yeah, to be I got honest. that feel That too, is yeah. a really nice touch. I mean, you talk about a creative beat. That's elaborate, to say the least. When you hear the intro, it sounds like the instrumental is is like tuning itself. It's trying to figure out when to come in. It's like when you're you know, tuning a radio and you're like, uh, what station do I want to listen to? You know, and you just hear all sorts of stuff. <laughs> you know, you hear the samples and hear, there's actually a quote from JFK. But I think they're trying to convey the feeling of the mysteries in the sky. And not just the sky, but beyond that. And then when the beat comes in, Guru gets going. Uh, he says, I self, Lord, and Master. Obviously, he's talking about himself, but I self, Lord, and Master, Islam. And I know there's a lot of connections with that in this song as well. Shall bring disaster to evil factors. Demonic chapters shall be captured by kings. So I am ready to release all of my demons. You know, I'm just ready to get rid of them to the storms of days after, unto the earth from the sun, through triple darkness to blast you. Now, triple darkness, I think that's kind of... Uh, the process of when the fetus is in the womb. So he could be talking about rebirth, but this also could be a double meaning because when you think of triple darkness, I kind of think of space because he says from the sun. So maybe he's kind of saying like, I'm a meteor coming through and just, you know, when I'm hitting earth, that's, that's what happens when you hit earth. <laughs> just get out of my way. With a force that can't be compared, to any firepower for its mind power share. So he's saying like, your mind is the most powerful weapon. The brain wave causes vessels to circulate like constellations reflect night off the lake. That's Not fire. only a great rhyme. That's fire. I think what he's saying is if we all think critically, you know, if we all come together, really use our minds, uh, you know, maybe we, we would live in a better society. Word to the father and mother earth, 
seeking everlasting life through this hell for what it's worth. Even though it can be hell on earth, I'm looking to go to the afterlife. And I think that's another thing that can propel you in the right direction for your mental health. And I think that's basically what he's getting at as a whole here. Just trying to cleanse yourself, become anew, and just saying how important it is to be in the correct state of mental health. I love the meaning and uh, he's killed us. The storms of days after and to the earth from the sun through triple darkness to blast you with a force that can't be compared to any firepower for its mind power shared. The brain weight causes vessels to circulate like constellations reflect at night off the lake. Word to the father and mother earth Baby. seeking everlasting life through this hell for what it's worth. Look, listen and observe. And watch another sea cycle pulling my peeps to the curb. Heed the words, it's like ghetto style proverbs. The righteous pay a sacrifice to get what they deserve. Cannot afford to be confined to a cell. Brain waves swell, turning a desert to a well. Experience the best teacher. Thoughts will spray like street sweepers. Little daddy street preacher, illustrious feature. Narrator you select, accompanied by deck, plus the DJ you respect. The seven and a half combined over the front line. The ten percenters promoting slam. They're in the airtime, bear in mind, jewels be the tools of the trade Sharp blades, heavenly praise, and dues are paid Above the crowds, above the clouds, where the sounds are original Infinite skills create miracles Yeah, I mean, the, the beat, man, this instrumental is so fire yeah. I mean, I cannot stress that enough I like the uh, Asian beat, and a lot of people recently have been using that Asian feel in a lot of songs. It has aged well, mm -hmm. actually. So in the second part of this, he's kind of talking about even in a bad situation, you can always turn that into a positive. And he says confined to a cell. So maybe he's talking about, you know, even when you're in jail or even prison, that's an opportunity to really focus on how to better yourself, how to better your mind and open up your mind. Brainwave swell, turning a desert to a well. Experience the best teacher. We all know that you have to have bad experiences sometimes if you want to better yourself. I mean, it, it's kind of like a wake-up call. You have to have it. Thoughts will spray like street sweepers. So when you have that experience, when you have more knowledge, next time you know what to do. Narrator you select, you are the narrator of your own story. Then he says, uh, the 10 percenters promoting slander in the airtime. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think 10 percenters are kind of like the people that know the secrets of the world. Oh, yeah. Do you know more about that? No, I just know like whenever you say certain amount of percenters or whatever, the top 5% or the top 10% or whatever, you're talking about the people that basically run the world. Right. Yeah, so Jeff Bezos and you know Bill Gates and yeah. all that. What they're trying to do through media, everything else, they are trying to put you in a negative space. They will do what they get. Here's how you should live. Here's who you should hang out with. Here's what you should look like. And it's just all fake. You just got to block that out. And he says, bear in mind, jewels be the tools of the trade. And I think the jewels is basically what he was saying up until that point. Sharp veins, heavenly praise, and dues are paid. That can mean death. He's basically saying, when I'm dead and gone, I want to make sure my dues are paid. I don't want to go in the afterlife and then be like, well, you did this. You did this, you did this. Uh, what do you have to say for yourself? I want to have that all sorted out. Just an excellent verse by Guru. And I love his monotone style. Nobody else really sounds like that. Rest in peace to him and uh, just, just an excellent introduction to this song. Brainwave swell, turning a desert to a well. Experience the best teacher. Thoughts will spray like street sweepers. Little daddy street preacher, illustrious feature. Narrator you select, accompanied by deck. Plus the DJ you respect. Seven and a half combined over the front line. The ten percenters promoting slander in the airtime. Bear in mind, jewels be the tools of the trade. Sharp blades, heavenly praise, and dues are paid. Above the crowds, above the clouds, where the sounds are original. Infinite skills create miracles. Warrior spiritual. Above the clouds, raining down, holding it down. Yeah, I leave scientists mentally scarred. Triple extra large, wild like rock stars who smash guitars. Poison bars from the guards, bust holes in your morale. Catch a charge, shake them down like the riot squad Invade your zone, ruin like ancient Rome I span the universe and return the earth to claim my throne The maker, owner, plus soul controller Ayatollah rest in the sky to clouds my sofa I mean, we could just shut it down right now God bless We can shut down everything right now Hit pause, uh, when we get out of here, make sure you turn off the lights uh, Let's just go home yeah, shut it down. <laughs> In the first 10 seconds of Dex's verse, he writes one of the best verses of all time. I don't even have to repeat 
this. Just, just look it up, listen to the song. Just pick up your jaw off the floor. This is ridiculous. He's got a nice flow too. When this man comes on a song, good night. Good night and good luck, sleep tight, don't let the bed bugs bite. It just sounds like somebody who just came from the afterlife. And I think what he's basically saying is what Guru was saying, except to the 10th degree. And actually I think in, when you hear Guru, he is attempting to become better, but it sounds like Deck is already there. This is what it feels like to be on top. You know, I'm on cloud nine. No outside forces are gonna get me off of it. Th this cloud is my sofa. He just wrecks this song. Just, just comes to it like that. Yeah, you could tell just how he comes in. It's just so much energy. He has one of those voices where once he comes on, you know who it is. It's the confidence. Exactly. The and swagger. Like, exactly, and it's... Undeniable. Not a lot of people have that, so... No. Spiritual, above the clouds, raining down. Holding it down. Yeah, I leave scientists mentally scarred. Triple extra large, wild like rock stars who smash guitars. Like, on, Poison man. bars from the guards, bust holes in your mirage. You catch a charge, shake them down like the riot squad. Invade your zone, ruin like ancient Rome. I span the universe to return the earth to claim my throne. The maker, owner, plus soul controller. Ayatollah, rest in the sky, the clouds my sofa. Stand like colossus, regardless to whom or what. Numerous attempts in my life, so who to trust? Who but us to supply her with the fire, the burning truth, 150 absolute proof on the mic like Moses spoke in Golden Squad, survivor of the oldest tribe whose soldiers died. I know the five families, we shed tears and mourn, but our hands are on the ammo because the battle's still on. Sound that is fire right there. I am so glad he put that in this song as well. He talks about how, again, outside forces that try to maybe discourage your beliefs. And he's saying that, you know, I stand like Colossus. I stand strong. I don't let them affect me. On the contrary, I actually try to help those people. You know, I try to bring them into my circle. I notified families, we shed tears and mourn, but our hands are on the ammo because the battle is still on. You know, this could be a real life thing. Maybe he actually lost some people. You know, maybe some people were killed. For whatever reason, they just didn't want to listen to me. You know, I tried. It just didn't happen. You know, just because I can't help one person doesn't mean I'll fail everyone else. That's beautiful, man. I mean, uh, hats off to him for putting an important subject like that in there, you know. Anytime you're trying to better yourself and go in a new direction, you can't do it alone. You always need help. Numerous attempts in my life, so who to trust? Who but us? To supply her with the fire, the burning truth. 150 absolute proof on the mic like Moses spoke in Golden Squad. Survivor of the oldest tribe whose soldiers died. I know the five families, we shed tears and mourn. But our hands are on the ammo because the battle's still on. Sound the horn. Come rumbling through the function, precise laser beam technique to touch something when we die hard. They build a monument to honor us with humongous effect in the world. We could have conquered it above the clouds, above the clouds where the sounds are original. Infinite skills create miracles. Warrior spiritual above the clouds, raining down, holding it down. Above the clouds, above the clouds where the sounds are original. Infinite skills create miracles. Warrior spiritual above the clouds, raining down. Holding it down. Yeah. You have to let this beat run out. You have to. Got the vinyl sound. No, that is an all-timer for me. I mean, you just talk about two perfect verses, an incredible instrumental. I mean, what more do you want from this song? And the lyrics are great, the writing, the, the message and the meaning are just fire. Who doesn't want to improve their mental health? This is just a fantastic reminder that uh, you can do anything you set your mind to. That is not only one of my favorite hip-hop songs, but maybe just songs in general. You know, I really do think it's, it's that great. This is uh, definitely... Making my playlist. This is actually really fire. <laughs> yeah. For something that was like so short, you know, and it, but it had so much meaning to it. It's really surprising, you know, how well it sounded. Because, you know, people say, oh, it should be more. No, it's enough said. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Especially in this. Now look at the lyrics. You know Again, saying? just yeah. read the lyrics. <laughs> yeah, enough said. They got yeah, to their point and they got it across. And I didn't get to everything, man. There's a lot of double meanings in here. Yeah, I could tell. You know, yeah. I didn't go line by line. I mean, 
Yeah. You can have an hour reaction video on this song. Yeah, every line is deep in itself. You know, it's not like there's a lot of today's rap, you know. Oh, you'll where, never see this. They're a verse. <laughs> this one verse alone is like more than anybody's catalog. And DJ Premier is actually fire. So yes. he, he makes a lot of really good beats. Yes. And this might be his best beat, which is saying something. I mean, I, I haven't heard all of them, but this one right here, man. And I hate to kind of sound like the old man, get off my lawn. You just wouldn't see like this, anything like this today. It's just not going to happen. I'm sure it's out there. Just not not to this level, but lyricism is Well, the out thing there. is, yeah, there is lyricism out there. It's just it doesn't get the praise. Yeah. The praise is people that have the beats. The sound. And the yeah. sound. There's no more yeah. lyrics anymore. It's about how you sound and what the beat sounds like. Which is sad because, I mean, the lyrics do help a song. And, yeah. you know, saying something like this, you know, that beat was not complex at all. It's very simple, actually. Yeah. It's not that, you know, there's no no extra stuff into it. No, that's a very simple beat. It kind of... So kinda, much meaning into it, it's crazy yeah. how, how good it sounds. I was going to say it kind of tricks your mind, though. Exactly. Like, it sounds like there's a lot probably going on, but in reality... It's not, but it's just a fantastic beat. Period. Yeah, I think that Asian, the Asian sound is. Yeah, I've, I definitely love the Asian is, sound. Yeah. The bloom, bloom, bloom. Yeah, that yeah. yeah, that sound is is very fire to me. I love that sound. I just can't say enough good things about the writing. I mean, I don't know how long it took him to do this. This is just a work of art. This is an example of artists at their peak. I mean, this is like the Sistine Chapel of hip hop. It's like an artist with a paintbrush. You know, it's Da Vinci and the Mona Lisa. <laughs> That's really what it is. Shout out to Gangstar for that timeless classic. You know, tell us what you thought about that song, what this song means to you. Uh, and give us some suggestions for more old school hip hop. That was the golden era. Let's be honest. Again, shout out to Gangstar. That is an exceptional track. That's it, guys. Don't forget to drop a like. And as always, please tell us your views. Thank you for subscribing and clicking that bell. Peace, Peace out. out.